pamilya ang, ay ang ating kanabukasan. Ang pagiging magulang ay importanteng yugto ng pag-unlad ng isang pamilya. So magandang umaga po sa ating lahat at tapos napakahalaga po ang pag-celebrate natin ng Family Week celebration. Dapat na hindi lang the week, araw-araw po. Kasi ganun po kahalaga ang pamilyang Pilipino sa bawat isang Pilipino sa ating bayan, sa ating bansa at para sa buong mundo. Maraming maraming salamat and happy uh, National Family Week celebration. And my, my emphasis for the topic is actually become parents who are present. The presence of the parents are very important to educate our kids, not what our words, but the way we express the qualities that is in the word of presence. Presence means patience, respect, you know, enthusiasm. Mental health is very common in the Philippines and is very depressing that their potentials are not realized. As such, the family has a very vital role in strengthening and preserving mental health. According to President David O. McKay, a happy home is an earthly heaven. As such, all of us will strive, need to strive to build a gospel-centered home, a heavenly home here on earth. Familia ay ang lugar kung saan ang buhay ay nag-uumpisa at natatapos kung saan ang may mga kapansanan, may mga sakit ay makikita na may pagtanggap, pagmamahal at pangangalaga. And I'm here to help in the celebration and commemoration of Family Week together with our friends in the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. This morning, I was given the opportunity to share with you some insights on the trends in legislation in fa on families, the rights of families, the rights of children. In relation to that, how the, the, the current technologies of digital media affect families. And we will see that uh, media, which is supposed to unite people, instead has a tendency to uh, divide. And that should not be the case because media should be at the service of the human person and the human community. The most important thing that I learned today that it is not the individual who creates a family, but rather it is the family who creates an individual. As members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, we know how important it is um, that our homes are centered on family. Happiness and families are established and maintained on principles of faith, prayer, Repentance, forgiveness, respect, love, compassion, work, and wholesome recreational activities. I'm Father Carlos Reyes. I am the Minister for the Ministry of Ecumenism and Interfaith Affairs of the Archdiocese of Manila. And I was invited by the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter day Saints to attend the Observance of the National Week of the Family. Uh, we have been attending uh, the observance for several years now, and I was asked by Ms. Heidi Bardo to uh, give a little uh, input on the spirituality of the family. And while Catholic doctrine teaches that God's design of a family is that of a man and a woman be bound in holy matrimony for their own good and for the good of their children, we still wish to proclaim the good news of the family to all. Well, families is important and I think it's really that uh, it's our job to continue to strengthen our families because it is a gift from God. I pray that the church, whatever religion that is, the LGUs, LGUs and the NGOs will come together and address these pressing issues. Tungo sa maginhawa, so we pray for the families and we encourage all the families to uh, this observance of National Week of the Family to be grateful for the gift of being a part of a family. Thank you very much.